we're based in France, we have the French DNA, we know what we do, but we go to New Horizons, we cater for other things, and we want to see bigger stages and lift bigger trophies, and that's what we do with this Valorant project. Hi, my name's Anne. I'm the head of esports at Team Vitality. I've been here for a year. Um, I'm German, but have recently relocated to Paris and yeah, living the dream here. To maintain the high standard of Team Vitality, a lot goes on behind the scenes. We currently have around 70 employees that, you know, full time work for us and put a hard work and dedication into it. Those are great and talented, creative people that put a lot of hard work in every day to deliver to the standards that we have. Vitality, the way it is today, I think, comes from a big entrepreneurial journey from our two founders, Nico and Neo. There was a lot of ambition behind the project and a lot of risk, and then a success story in the end. I think the nine last years really come from sweat and tears, from bringing the local French scene international and just combining passion for a big project. We have the French DNA, we were made here, but we've taken a step to go international. That doesn't mean you can just cut out the roots. We have our headquarters here, we cater to our French fans, and this is where we come from. We will not forget those roots. But at the same time, we're trying to reach further horizons and going international for to really grasp all the fans that you know could follow us on Valorant. So the relocation to Berlin is a twofold decision. One is because our operations are already possible there. We have a great office with a lot of facilities for the players. And two, the team actually requested to relocate early because they wanted to get a head start on training together. We were already like very well prepared, you know, like to moving into Berlin. Uh, we get like a lot more time than the other teams just hanging out together, getting to know each other. Uh, so yeah, it's, it's very nice that we actually got like all the preparation done so early on that we could just move in here whenever we wanted to. Hi, my name is Santri, bone called Sassi. I play for Team Vitality and uh, I'm the in-game leader. I feel like we, like me and Vitality, have like the same principles on like just eSport itself. There are a lot about like performance, there are a lot about just winning. So uh, for me, it's very nice to just be here, you know, like uh, with like some of the superstars of Vitality, meeting them. And uh, I feel like me and Vitality, we just, we get along really well. What makes us like the biggest threat for other teams? I feel like a lot of a lot of them is going to think us as uh, like underdogs. I feel like the team that we have built is going to be a total dark horse in the tournament. People have gotten you know like superstar players like from last season, and uh, I, I feel like us we're just going to go there and uh, just play extremely solid, and they're, they're not going to like know what's going to hit them. For us, really, the international stage is where it's at, and so we're looking at the international competitors that can keep up with us in terms of operations and performance. What are we going to do in next season? Oof, it's going to be magnificent. Team Vitality is going to push to new things. We get super close to fans. Our players talk to fans, meet to fans. They get to see them in real life. There's real touch points there. Our Valorant team has this unique character where they really love interacting with the fans. They live for this. They're excited and we really want to bring them closer to the fans.